There we go. I had to wait till the game told me I could do it. It's just my natural gaming instincts just to jump when I see a thing like that, you know? Man, it's very bloomy. I forgot that the uh, previous generation loved its bloom effects until your eyes popped. Oh, this looks nice. Let's go this way. Oh, there's a monster there. Hey, dude. Whoop. Oh, not you, assholes. Alright, dodge him. Oh, wait, hold on. No, better idea. Perfect. I think I think uh, Terramas was explaining about West being a servant, but then I died, so maybe he stopped. It's kind of nice you can just uh, transform like that, and then stop it. I never like power ups that you have to use or like use them, and then you otherwise you like lose all the stuff. Ooh. Oh dear God! Oh God! It's like quick time event stuff. Oh shit! I'm so bad at these kind of things. Ah! Okay, we made it. That's not too bad. Hey. This looks like it's still falling, but we gotta kill things first. Hey, let me pick you up and smash you. Oh, that's beautiful. Here, let me pick you up and... Hold on. Let me... Let me... There we go. We'll just swing you around. You... You can be swung. Oh. Oh, we can pick two up at once. That's like my new favorite thing. Oh, yeah. Has the blood been sated, my friend? Yeah? Are you good? Yeah, he's good. He's not that fussy. This place really is a shithole. Uh-oh. Oh, downwards, I guess. Downwards is probably not correct. That seemed to be a mistake. Lucky we don't have lives. That's the one thing this is uh, This is being generous on. Lives in games are kind of mean. Stuff like Splatterhouse 2 was uh, all about that. And Splatterhouse 1. And uh, Splatterhouse 3. So this technically is the first Splatterhouse about lives. Which is just... Oh, no! Oh, guys, really? You guys are being mean with your checkpoints. Hold on, let me let me cut you up. Yeah. Love it. Alright, now I can probably open the door. We're not that far behind, I guess, in the grand scheme of things. Uh oh. But this time I'm gonna be super quick. Look how amazingly fast I am now. Yeah! Alright, back to smash. Whoop! Smash. Hold on. Oh, double smash. Double smash is legit the best one. Crunch. Are we good? No, we're not good. Hold on. They're all really puzzled about why they're getting murdered so hard. They're like, I don't get it. What's the problem? It's like, well, not really a problem per se. Okay, game. This is where you should have checkpointed. All right. After a little cutscene thing, that's, that's where you can do it. Okay, now where are we going? This way, I guess. Uh oh. Alright. See, I'm never sure if I'm going to make it or not. It gives me the fear. Uh, ooh, that looks bad. Oh, that's fucking weird. Oh, there's dudes. Oh, there's also a picture. Yoink. Oh, it's Jenny. See, that's a nice picture. Oh, that's the tickets. I thought she had a medal at first. It's the tickets. Okay. Well, that's kind of nice. Here, come here. Oh, hello. Oh, I just... We just breaks. I thought we could do something cool. Oh, there's a pipe. Pipe machete. Ow. You stop. Ow. Ow. G oh, 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 God. Oh, oh, oh. Man, I'm so sorry, Rick. You're just, you're just having a bad time here, aren't you? You're just having a real bad time. Because I'm controlling you and I've, I've ruined everything. This is why I should never be ill, by the way. I have a few days off and I forget how to do everything. Not that I was doing particularly amazing the first time. But it's the point that stands that it was... I'm just... Someone chuck me a shovel, all right? I'm digging a nice big hole here. Actually, just rip off my arm and use that as a shovel. That'll do. Hey, at least we had a... Uh, aha! Perfect. Come on, chop, chop, do I, need, I don't need to pick up the picture, guys. Chop, chop, chop! Right, you guys are kind of nasty, so I'm going to chop off your heads. Hey, don't duck. That's using advanced tactics and I'm just not behind. Alright. Tentacle boy is upstairs somewhere. You fancy coming down here, tentacle boy? Can we climb up and get him, maybe? Can I break him down? Nah. Yeah, do you want to try that again, mate? Alright, nice. Maybe I'm supposed to throw someone up at him. Oh, no, no. Yes. 
Alright. I mean, that kind of feels like a cowardly kind of thing to do. I thought we were just going to slap it. The Aegis can protect surrounding enemies. Alright, well, that's not a very nice thing for it to do. Oh, now this one we can break. I see glowy things. Sweet. Right, guys, you got to not break. Oh, hold on. Wow, that weapon was doing so much more. Way ahead of you, dude. Alright. Oh. Use Ram to stun the Aegis. Alright. Do I need to stun him like this? No. No, I did not. Yeah, good luck with that, guys. What, the Aegis went by way too fast? I agree. That was that was outrageous. Woo! Oh, that didn't kill him, did it? Sorry, that was my bad. Oh, hold on, let me... Hey! None of that. Shame on you. Hey! Guy ripped off my arm. I'm gonna beat you with the soggy end. Oh, asshole. Uh. This counts as a dangerous weapon. I got loads of blood to use. Loads and loads and loads. Come, come here! Sweet. Hey, my arm's back. Double victory. Uh. This definitely is the right way. Yes. You're gonna want to see this. Wait, 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 wait. No peeking. Surprise! No. A taste of the future. I, I don't understand. New York City, 13 months after you failed to save Jennifer. 13 months after the corrupted are set free. Jen. Oh, don't weep for Jen. You'll all be joining her soon enough. Is it too late? We've got until the eclipse reaches totality. Then let's go. Well, that's bad. That's actually really cool, though. We're in, like, some sort of spooky future. Like, I, I legitimately we had no idea. That's really awesome. I thought we, maybe we were, like, in a sort of parallel world or something. I don't know why. I'm always going with parallel worlds. But future, time travel makes sense. However, if time travel makes sense, then Dr. West... Uh, oh, yeah, let me just uh, crush your head. Oh, my God, that's awful. Oh, Jesus. We crushed his head. That, that's appalling. I love it. Um. Oh, ow. Stop that. Uh, anyone left alive? He's left alive. Let me hit you. Ugh! Nice. Tell me everything you know about the future. Oh, what? Who are you? Holy what shit. The fuck is that? That's what exactly what I was thinking. Here, have one of these. So how do we get through? It's a big mouth of a doorway, Rick. How do you think we get through? It. Nice. I'm totally behind that. Although I'm going to die if I'm not careful. I need to heal. Sharp move. There we go. So it makes things actually a little bit harder the fact you can't heal off the punch like, generally. If I'm doing it wrong and someone knows, someone let me know. But otherwise it just feel, it does feel a little bit harder. Right. We've healed up now. So what we need to do then is pick up you. In the mouth you go. Whoop. Get in there. Get in there. You? Can you go in there too? No, he can't. He's too big. So we'll just beat him up. Oh yeah, she doesn't he doesn't he doesn't care for that kind of shenanigans. Alright, we'll just smack him instead. Ooh. Oh wait, I missed him. Oh, oh Jesus! Guys, guys, we've talked about this. You gotta not you gotta not, you know, abuse me here, alright? We're all on the same team here. We all want the apocalypse. Wait, we don't? Oh well, never mind. Wait, how did I end up losing blood? What did I do? Did I derp? Not me. Oh, this looks important. I should pick this up. Right. right, let's kill the big guys, because they we can't throw them in. At least I don't think so. Nice. Okay, admittedly we killed a lot of the little guys there. Oh no, we're ripping them to pieces. That's also bad. Entertaining, sure, but bad. Oh wait, okay. Big guy, you're dying. You're dying. Okay. You're dying. And you're dying. Okay, now we got little guys. Right, come here. I've got a big gaping mouth 
face thing to feed in the Statue of Liberty. Which is super cool, by the way. That's incredibly imaginative. I love it. Get off me! Get off me, little freak. Okay, I need to heal in there, but first. In you go. Oh, I missed. That's awkward. In you go. Okay, that did miss. Right, let's, let's... Oh, wait, what? Well, that was abrupt. And that's really creepy. Why is there a monster living inside the Statue of Liberty? That's pretty freaking cool, though. I'm loving that. I'm loving the level design here. That's awesome. Unless, of course, the rest of the game get takes place in this sort of run-down city area, in which case I take it back. But I, I hope it doesn't. Again, I know this had loads of development troubles and stuff, but from what I've seen so far, this is a legitimately fun city game. And I love it. Four. The Meat Factory. Oh, well, that's gonna be a good one. <sighs> this place smells like shit. That reminds me of home. Aw. Uh, right, I'm gonna stop here, because the chapter seems like a perfect place to end this, even though it's a little bit short. So, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, and uh, next time, we'll go into the Meat Factory. Sorry for the delay, I wasn't feeling very good, and my voice was all croaky, which would have been basically no good for, uh, for recording stuff. So, uh, sorry about the delay. And uh, next time... The Meat Factory. Seriously though, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm having an absolute blast doing Splathouse. It's so ridiculously gory and unnecessarily violent and full of titties. And YouTube hates every single second of it, which makes me even happier to do it. Because honestly, giving them the middle finger sometimes makes everything worth it. Because <laughs> I'm a big child. Anyway, thanks everyone. Catch you later. Bye!